Today is October, 20, October 29th, 2016. Um, yesterday, um, we got a diagnosis from our son, who we recently found a tumor that was behind his ear, penetrating his brain. The tumor was about five centimeters and five centimeters large. After several scans, we have um, found that the cancer has gotten into his bone marrow, into his pelvic area and lower spine. After, after an open biopsy and about four weeks of waiting, uh, we finally got a diagnosis that it is, um, it's really hard to say what it is. Um, they don't really know. Um, what they are calling it is Ewing-like sarcoma, uh, which is a bone cancer. <laughs> Her doctor is telling us that he has 10% chance to make it past five years old. This is after intense chemotherapy, radiation, other forms of treatment. I'm recording this to ask for anyone's help who know of anyone who has gone through bone cancer, um, any type of sarcoma cancer, please let us know. Please have them email, call us, text us. Um, I'll post the link to all of our contact information. Right now, we're just, we are reluctant to start treatment until we know more about this. And, and research into where the best place to, to treat him at. <sighs> we will be um, starting a fundraiser uh, here soon. Um, we ask everybody to share their favorite moments with CJ. Tell us a time where he impacted your life, brought a smile to your face, or just brought joy to your life. Tabitha and I are the luckiest parents alive. He brought us so many smiles every single day. From day one, He's the happiest kid alive. <laughs> uh, we will be sharing all of your stories on um, either a Facebook page, on his um, fundraising page. <sighs>
I'm not really sure what else to say. Please pray for us. Pray for CJ. Send us positive texts, inspiring texts. If you come across any articles, websites, anything, please send it to us. You have kids. <sighs> Go give them the biggest hug you've ever given them. <laughs> Tell them you love them every single day. <laughs> Don't take life for granted. Those of you who know CJ, know he's a fighter. Know he's something very special. He will overcome this. He has so many people that care for him, that love him. He will survive this.